So we were buying our fabric from Joanne Fabric. And, but on the salvage, what they call the salvage, the edge of the fabric, you could see the company and the designer. So I was going to New York to visit a daughter of mine who was in college there. And I thought, I'm going to go in and pay a visit to this company to see if we can buy direct, because right now we're paying retail, obviously. So I went to New York, um, went to the company. Of course, I didn't have an appointment, so I was at the desk and uh, asked if I could see someone in sales. And they said, well, who are you with? And I said, Vera Bradley. Well, they thought it, Vera, there was a large company called Vera. So her mistake, not my, I swear I didn't drop the Bradley. I did not. I said, Vera Bradley. Um, and of course, there was no company. We were minuscule. So I was ushered into the vice president's office, vice president of sales. And, um, his name was Leo Driscoll, and he starts talking to me about what we're buying, and he said, how many pieces are you interested in? Well, pieces is a huge quantity in their language. Uh, pieces to me was how many pieces. So finally he catches on, we are not speaking the same language, and he said, who are you with? I said, Vera Bradley. He said, and what is that? I said, oh, it's a company we just started this you know, a year ago or less. And he said, well, how the hell did you get in here? And I know oh, I'm right through that door. You know, I have my coffee in hand. And, well, he got a huge kick out of it because he thought this was um, just, this doesn't happen in his world. And we became dear friends to the day he died, I might say. Became a friend of his wife and a friend of his. We stayed with them in their home on the vine and Martha's Vineyard. And they actually had a program at his training called Remember Vera Bradley because it was so, call it a God wink, whatever brought me into his office, whatever made him not kick me out of his office, we just connected. And we remained friends and then we became their largest customer. So um, it's things like that. And then I, I remember he, passed away and his wife called me and said, we really think of our friendship as so special. And who knew? I mean, how would something like that happen, you know? It was just something brought me there.